Next up is histogenics, and co-presenters are Adam Gridley, President and CEO, and John Lieber, CFO. As we're getting started, by a show of hands, uh, who in this room has had, or as a family member, who has had knee pain, knee injury, or osteoarthritis? So that's most of our investors, because every time they hear about the product that we're developing, they not only want to be in our clinical trial, they want to have our product when it's approved, and hopefully change their quality of life and the way that they're approaching these injuries. So I'm Adam Gridley, CEO of Histogenics. Our CFO, John, is with me today to tell you a little bit about our product, which is Neocart. We are treating the holy grail of orthopedics. When you talk to surgeons and patients, these injuries that they're presented with have significant loss of uh, function, significant pain, and there are no good treatments. We are currently running the world's leading clinical trial. It's been ongoing since 2010. It's 245 patients. It will be enrolled in three months. So for those of you with injuries, you got a couple months to get into the trial. And that hopefully leads to what we believe to be the best data in the world that leads to approval in the next couple of years. So the impact is really for healthy, active patients. These are teenagers. These are 30 and 40 year old patients who have an injury and there are no good treatments. It's 500 to 700,000 procedures each year. We think that there's another half a million or more patients who are sitting on the sidelines because the treatments just don't work. What we're trying to do is change the way that these treatments are being developed and develop ex vivo or outside of the body, a product where we're taking the patient's own cells, fusing them into a scaffold, and we're creating a living piece of cartilage tissue. This is a neocart donor from one of our clinical trials. And when they receive the product, there are a number of benefits. We believe that this is a platform technology. This is compelling technology that can be used outside of the knee. And hopefully, we can treat those patients early enough where they get a teenage piece of cartilage that starts the process over, prevents multiple surgeries, and prevents osteoarthritis. We think this will have a dramatic impact on our industry and has a number of applications more broadly. John's going to take you through briefly a little bit more about the product. So among the reasons why we're so excited about Neocard is for, first of all, starting with the advantages to the patient. So we're talking about an earlier and quicker recovery in terms of pain and function for the patient compared to other therapies and treatments that are either in development or on the market. We're talking about an earlier return to work and activity compared to the other therapies with less rehab and importantly less pain meds, which is of course important based on the, because of the opioid crisis that we have in the country right now. In addition, it's an easy physician, it's an easy procedure for the physician to do. Procedure takes about 30 minutes, open or close. We actually have one of the clinicians in our clinical trial who did his first three neocarts in the same day. His third procedure, 20 minutes, he was, he was in and out, done. So it's super easy for the physician. In terms of the defect, the defect is up in that middle panel on the top side there. And what you can see is those are MRI pictures from different patients in our trial. As early as eight weeks, what you can see is that the cartilage implant is integrating with the native cartilage around it. And what that means is faster return to, to recovery. We've got marathoners in our trial who are doing marathons five months after the procedure, construction workers who are back to work. And now I'll turn it back to Adam real quick to finish up. So we are a Boston company. We've been around since 2000. This is a very tough space, both from a regulatory and from a scientific perspective. We've got two facilities, one across the highway uh, over in Waltham. We've got about 50 employees, most of whom are in R&D and manufacturing. We are making neocarts every day. 24 hours a day, and that leads to what we think is going to be a significant regulatory advantage and a great amount of safety data available for the patients. We have another facility in Lexington. We're working closely with the universities of Brigham and Women and Harvard, and we're working with young scientists as we think about hiring and expanding upon launch and hope to be growing to well north of a couple of hundred uh, employees in that process. So look forward to talking to you after the, uh, the presentation, and thanks for your attention.